mission of E5, really, when you knock it down, is to make kids smile. Inspiration came from uh, a hospital visit in Philadelphia. I had a couple of teammates, Kevin Sefcik, Rico Brony, and I. Uh, we were playing for the Phillies at the time, and when we got there, we found that these children were diagnosed with terminal cancer. And I knew that, uh, you know, I can't, I couldn't cure these kids, um, but I, I can help them and their families and, and uh, create the Five Foundation and uh, uh, give them a, a spot to relax and play and and have fun and continue high five and even though a lot of the things in their life aren't where they want them at that moment. Through the help of um, charitable organizations throughout the state for selection, we invite families and children in special needs and uh, this for for everybody, for that family that's invited here to be able to take a break, step away from some of the hardships they have in their life and and be outdoors in nature and, and uh, just get a great weekend. What Camp Emmaloo is, I think to anybody that's been out here and seen it, myself as well, is, is laughter and kids playing and kickball games and wiffle ball games, fishing tournaments, and bonfires. Uh, Camp Emmaloo is alive. Team Field Trips are our most recent program. We've partnered up uh, with MCCSC School Corporation and we're the sponsor for the sixth grade field trips out here at Camp Emmaloo. I mentioned that these are team field trips. Team stands for teamwork. You're gonna work together in a lot of these groups to accomplish tasks. Ah! Here, Holly, I'll get it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. What all did we find, guys? E in team is for exercise. You're going to get plenty of that today. Oh! Oh! I'm going down here. Okay. Woo! I love this slide. A is for accountability. Who knows what accountability means? Hands. Wow. Couldn't have said it better. Taking responsibility. And M in, in team stands for mentorship. We've got leaders from Bloomington High School North, and we have leaders from Bloomington High School South. Those are your mentors, your teachers, your leaders. A tale of two heroes. Once upon a time, a brave eight-year-old boy named Tyler met baseball player Scott Rowland. While Scott was crushing fastballs and curveballs, Tyler was battling leukemia. The two became fast friends and heroes to each other. When Scott began to build Camp Emmalou, Tyler wanted to help. He donated his own money to create this treehouse. With the help of many friends, Tyler's treehouse grew to encompass all of the things Tyler loved. As you play here, may your life be touched by Tyler's spirit. Fight hard, no limits, never give up. Tyler was diagnosed with leukemia when he was around seven years old. And uh, wonderful, wonderful kid, wonderful spirit. Uh, really a, a unique situation. He was always a kid that, you know, even though that uh, he and his family were in a situation medically that they needed, they needed support, and they needed funding. They always somehow turned it around and found a way to, to help other people. And we wanted to do something special for Tyler. And at the time we were doing a series of fundraisers in Indianapolis. So we thought it would be a neat idea to kind of make Tyler our, uh, our hero for the evening. So Scott gave one of his, uh, his ball gloves and, and we burned some, some, some hero and, and love and, and, and things into the, into the webbing of the glove that we thought stood for Tyler. We presented that to him at a, one of our events, our, one of our galas and, uh, of about 300 adults in a room. He was dressed completely in a suit. Uh, he didn't have any hair at the time. And we called him up in front of the group this room of 300, right? And 
Scott presented him with the, uh, the Hero Award. Scott hands him the microphone and he says, proceeds to tell his story. He thanks us again for the, for the award. And he starts to tell us how over the past two years, he and his buddies uh, in his fourth grade class uh, had been raising money. They had come up with this logo of, of called No Limits and they would put this logo on t-shirts and coffee mugs and, and things and his friends were selling them around the school and the neighborhoods and they were taking that money and putting it into Tyler's medical fund to help pay for his medical bills. And this is where it gets, it defines who people are and who families are. Um, because Tyler found a way to say, you know what, I appreciate everything you guys have done, but I'm gonna take the rest of this money and I'm, I'm not doing too well, but I wanna make sure that I can pay this forward. And so he took that money and it was $1,000 that they had deposited into his account. And he proceeds to reach into his suit pocket and present Scott with a check for $1,000. And his only request was, could you build a tree house down at the camp where other kids like me can go and play and feel normal? We talk about opportunity a lot here at the camp. Well, there are an awful lot of people in that room that saw this as their opportunity. And they took that first step that evening. Long story short, within about two and a half weeks, we had a national auction going on, the Bob and Tom Show. We were able to raise somewhere over $200,000 for Tyler's Treehouse with just his first donation. So his small step and his mentality of service and paying it forward resonated so much not only with kids his own age but transcend into the adults that you couldn't help but sit in that room and think I need to do something here. Did Tyler really realize that one thousand dollars would do all of this? Did he realize that every dime he had and that he raised made all this? And how much fun and joy he's brought to all of these kids and every other kid that will ever come to Camp Emilu? It's amazing. Seventeen years ago, I walked into the Temple Children's Hospital. When I walked out, my life had changed. I had the opportunity to make a meaningful difference in people's lives that needed it the most. I took the first step. I invite you to do the same. I promise you, it's an incredible ride.